let's go ahead and just uh, introduce the rosters right here. I think we're going to be getting underway with this first heat in uh, just a few minutes. Uh, so for in uh, lane two, we're going to have Fringe D. Uh, they're going to be pushing Bisa. Uh, the driver is going to be Tisha Girdhar. Hill one is going to be Monica Berrigan. Hill two, Rebecca Lee. Hill three, Dia Nuxall. Hill four, Elizabeth Armin. And Hill five, Sophie Yang. Uh, Apex A is going to be in lane one. They're in Firefly. The driver is Ariana Mapua. Hill one is Marissa Schwartz. Hill two, Shawnee Rosenthal. Hill three, Olivia Swick. Hill four, Aaron Ryan. And Hill five, Francis Moore. And Tisha Gerdhar is the driver there for Fringe D. Ariana Mapua for Apex A. And both buggies are down on the course. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ready, set. And here we are, race day 2018 officially underway. Apex A coming up here on Hill 1. Uh, definitely out pushing Fringe D right there as we come into this first transition. Still coming here for one to two. And there's the shove right there. 23 seconds away. Not too bad. Let's see here how it goes into the free roll. It's our first look at a driver-filled buggy through this maze of, of potholes here. And a pretty nice line there. You can kind of see there's a little bit of a diagonal between the different parts of pavement. Um, and Apex A now coming out into the free roll. And you, you can you can see Fringe coming up just in the in the frame now. And obviously this is an A team versus a D team, so you're not necessarily expecting a, a, an ultra competitive heat here. Um, Apex A should be, win this win this heat easily. One uh, item we always kind of look at is the stop sign time. You know, how fast are you there? That was a 107. I think the top teams are closer to 102 or so. One minute. Michael, they should be coming your way now. Yep, she's just past the top flag. Looks like a pretty smooth ride down the chute. There's a signal flag in the chute. And the uh, turn looks pretty smooth, a little bit on the inside. Apex and looks great. Very nice right there. Apex hitting the apex. And here we go into the back hills on that transition with three. One of the toughest transitions. You really don't want to have to shove this too much. It looks like the bike got, got away a, a little she bit. She got a there. little beat. And that, that was a common theme this spring is teams missing the pickup on hill three. Fringe also looked like they got beat a little bit there. Uh, it looks like Fringe actually closed a little bit of distance right there. It does. Again, you would think with an A-team, Apex will probably pull away on these back hills, but they, they are. Yeah, and you can see that right there, the three to four, not great right there by Fringe D. Apex A, Aaron Ryan, this hill four pusher, cruising right now, crossing over the 215 mark here. In their time last year was a 248.98 on final. Let's see how they stack up against that as they transition the four to five. Francis yeah. Moore taking over Push. there. Hill Probably five pusher for Apex A. Woo. Probably gonna be close, maybe a little behind that, although that was their final time, so. We'll see, uh, they certainly were not pushing in like 38 degree weather at that point. The sun coming out though. Yeah towards that finish line there. Again, the hand needs to be on the push bar as they cross over that finish line. Let's make sure she's got a grip. Gives it one last shove at 255.47 right there. Fringe D now coming up towards that finish. And they're coming through here, gonna be a little bit past three minutes. And their time last year was a 3.09, so they're, they're a little behind last year's time as well. But again, with the, the way the temperature and the rolls this spring, I'm not surprised to see teams a, a few seconds behind where they were last year. 